and welcome back to MLB The Show 19 and the Salamon Barrios Road to the Show. I'm Tyron Saber. Last time out, eh, I don't really remember last time out, actually. These things kind of blend in after a while, but uh, we did manage to get quite a few walks against the Texas Rangers, actually. I was kind of surprised by that. Um, yeah, no home runs, but we did get a couple hits, so we acquitted ourselves fairly well, I would say, out here. Uh, yeah, so let's keep going. We got a four-game series coming up against the Seattle Mariners. I imagine we'll have a training day first off. So let's get on that. Just about capped on all that stuff. That's not great. Uh, gonna work on arm accuracy, I think. On account of if we're gonna stay out here in the field... In out in uh, right field, which I don't want, but I feel like we are going to. It's going to happen. We might as well do that and have at least two assists over the next three games. I am focusing on something else right now. I am not getting assists by any stretch of the imagination. More power for Solomon. Say it ain't so. And the boy doesn't need any more power. Clearly, that's a lie, though, but uh, in any case, that's going to bring us out here against the Seattle Mariners in Anaheim. So let's get out here and get it. We are under the lights this evening as we get you set for another edition of baseball on MLB Network. A Memorial Day get together for you here at the ballpark between the Seattle Mariners and the Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim. Two great hitters lead their teams to battle next on MLB Network. Andrew Heaney, a left-hander out of Oklahoma, will be on the mound. Dan, any thoughts? Hey, this guy's done a real good job on the year of keeping the opponent's batting average down. Both righties and lefties coming into this one, hitting under 250 against this guy. He's been good all season long. Let's play ball. You're out. That reminds me, I feel obliged to say it on account of uh, I hadn't noticed it previously, but we did in fact get Kyle Schwarber on our team from the uh, Cubs, I think is where we got him from. But to get him, we had to trade a couple players, and one of those players was our good friend, uh, 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 Tyler Skaggs. And there's Tyler Skaggs one. was and one of the people traded in the deal for Kyle Schwarber, so he is no Maybe longer on the Angels. Of but of course, he is going to remain an Angel in our hearts, and we yeah, wish him the best in his future endeavors with the Cubs. If they elevate, good chance Carl Dixon's punching your ticket. Lifts it into the air. Loops that shallow center field. And that'll be the third out of the inning, and that is going to bring the Mariners back the up to hit. Gone in order. We are still scoreless. Riding in once again, oh, Solomon Barrios. 0 for the 1 for him here in this one. Solomon Barrios. All right, what do we want to do? Uh, do, do not record it out within the first four pitches, I guess. Angels are up three to nothing here, bottom of the third with two out. First pitch of the at bat. Cut her down, taken for strike one. Hey, get your pitch and drive it right here. The pitch. Sinker to the outside corner, so Solomon taking two pitches and uh, now in the hole, 0-2. Nope. Change up near the corner. Well, that's a smart miss there. Sometimes guys will chase it down there, especially when they're in protect mode on an 0-2 count. Sinker well inside, so manage the plate discipline challenge on that one. And the cutter got him uh, swinging. Strike three in the side. Couldn't is pull the trigger on that one. Froze me on the cutter. Angels go down one, two, three. But they lead it three, nothing. 
Well, Solomon, 0 for 2 on the day. Now they're suggesting we drive in a run without recording an out and with bases loaded and two out here. Seems like a good time to use some showtime. Two walks in this inning already, so he can't expect to stay out there much longer if he puts somebody else on. We'll see if he can find it. That evens it up. One Sinker one. down. Quite nasty. Oh, at third, McNeil over at second. Hey, Robertson at go, first, go, two out in the inning. That is going to... Connected go, go, go. on that one, and it's going. But, in fact, he catches it at the wall, and that is going to end the inning. Man, that one was close, though. A couple of walks, but no damage. More baseball on MLB Network right after this. So Salomon finally getting a chance to field out here. Tim Anderson on the plate. One out in the top of the sixth. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Calling for it. Salomon makes a kind of inefficient route to that one, but that'll be the first out of the inning. And he gets one more shot out here in the bottom of the eighth. He's 0 for 3 on the day. Strikeout and a couple flyouts. 25,668 people here in Angel Stadium of Anaheim. The Angels, thank you for your support. First and second here with nobody out. And Way outside on that one. Either, Ball two. two. The 2 0 on the way. Ooh, that is a good one, too. A little bit of sink action on that one. That one. Really just not paying too much attention here. Fastball below the zone. Takes it for ball three. Filling the count. And he walks Salomon. So it's going to be an 0 for 3 day for Salomon, more than likely. But he does get a walk on the day to keep his OBP respectable. And that'll bring out Justin Bohr. He's got some pop in that bat of his, so here's hoping he can do something. Oh, here's hoping he can succeed where Salomon failed earlier. Well, not with a swing like that. A couple of righties starting to loosen now in the bullpen. Mariners hoping that they'll have one more shot in the uh, bottom of the ninth or that uh, they'll be able, preparing for the worst, perhaps, I guess the better way, way to put it. Has it, but and I'd be surprised Mitch Hanniger comes in on that pop fly. Can of corn and makes the first out. Here comes J Justin Upton. McNeil on third. Robertson on second. Barrios is over at first with one away. Rounder over to second. Solomon tries to take him out, but in fact, that is going to end the inning. Just what the doctor ordered. He gets the double play to get him out. Regardless, top nine, we got Brian Goodwin on. It's looking like a complete game here, possibly, from Andrew Heaney. 108 pitches. Right Liner field. to right field and light that baby up. Andrew Heaney gets himself a complete game shutout in 109 pitches. Not a Maddox, but nobody's going to complain about that. Solomon, meanwhile, 0 for 3 with a walk. 
And that's pretty much all he was able to accomplish today. Pitching was pretty good. And the balls he did hit in play, a little bit bad luck on where they land. Wednesday night baseball on the show from Angel Stadium of Anaheim. Tonight, it's an in-division matchup from the AL West between the Seattle Mariners and the Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim. The Halos have now won five consecutive games. They'll aim to continue their winning streak next. Aaron Sanchez, a California-born right-hander, is on the mound. Dan Plezak, what's the word on him? This guy's a fun guy to watch pitch. It seems like the more trouble he gets in, the better he pitches. Really tough to hit with runners in scoring position, and that's one of the reasons why his team loves when he's out on the mound. He doesn't give up very many Batter, crooked Batter. numbers. The right fielder. So digging in now, Solomon, Solomon Barrios. Oh, a okay. real threat with the bat, of course, as he currently leads the American hey, League in home runs. Oh, yeah, it's still early in the year. Right Feeling now. good that we're and still leading the AL in home runs, but threat. the Mariners have us down two to nothing start, in the like to see him have a hot early going here. Now. So Solomon no taking a changeup down from who is this? Anton Ramirez, or maybe Anton Ramirez. Nice four seamer to the outside corner. Can't be happy with the way they play. I give him a lot of credit. I give the pitchers a lot of credit for balls going to the outside, maybe more than I should, just because I feel like I swing and miss way too much on stuff that winds up outside the zone. Change up inside corner, taken 3 1. has been good all season so far. They've looked especially dominant as of late. What's been clicking in particular for them lately, guys? Connected on that one, but that is going to get down into the glove of the center fielder, and that is going to end the inning. That will end the inning. Some of our nation's young minds and future leaders here in attendance. Yikes. The three of us return with more Wednesday night baseball after this. Striding forward now, the Mariners clean up. It's now six to nothing here. Not a good look for the Angels after a respectable win yesterday. Hit the other way out Next hit, right though, field. out to the Moving land of Solomon. And he's out there to get it with a little fumbling around. And that is the first out of the inning. And he comes out at bottom in, five with a runner on Mario. second and he one out. Almost, Matty. Almost oh, went Rio. deep his last AB. Certainly oh, just oh, missed oh, it. Oh, with this guy's big oh, power, oh, he's feeling pretty Down, please. Look for him nope. to try and get on something. That was just humiliating. Malik Smith. Here comes Malik Smith. Top six man. with two out. Yeah, guys, everyone Nobody on. Slumping. Dan, you can certainly attest to this. Only amassing a solid one hit in your entire career. And, he'll get and that's going to end the inning with another fly ball out to Solomon. And we now come out here bottom seven. Two runs in for the Angels, but still down 6-2. Fastball down and in, taken for ball one. Anthony Swarzak now out here for the Mariners. The one -oh. And that one is just going to be a roller over there to second, and that is going to be the first out of the inning. So Solomon not doing what he needs to do out here. But by the top of the eighth, it's back to 6-5. And the Mariners. Jeff McNeil back to get it. Solomon backing him up, and that'll end the inning. So... At the very least, we get a chance to do some more damage against these guys. And in fact, Solomon will be leading off the inning. So Dan Altavia coming out here for the Mariners to pitch against Solomon. Again, 0 for 3 on the night. Not the performance you'd like to see. I, you know, I'm not really complaining about the results that Solomon has been having in the contact. It just hasn't been falling for hits. At 23,101 people in the stands tonight, uh, Solomon obviously wants to give him a show. 
reward their support with a big old ding dong. That's not a big old ding dong, but that is a nice little single up the middle to give himself a base hit. So it's not nothing. I was really hoping for something of a bigger hit there, actually, Solomon, considering a power swung and everything, but I guess we'll just take what, take what they give me. I'm going to try to steal a base just to make myself feel better. Nope, not so much. And the Angels... Actually, light that baby up. No thanks to Solomon, really. Shohei Otani, of all people, being the hero with the bat. Go figure. Now from the Big A, we've got afternoon baseball from Angel Stadium of Anaheim. Today, a matchup out of the American League Western Division between the Seattle... Robbie Ray, a southpaw from Tennessee, is the I man won't lie, I'm kind of in a hurry this morning. Here, Danny? Hey, one of the, the things this guy does Omar. really well, Darn neutralize the left-handed hitters. On the season, lefties are hitting... And we'll have Solomon to had to there. run to get that one, but he made the play, and that'll end the first. So two runs come across here, both coming via the solo home run. Now the and Solomon still out here. We got one runner in already and another one on second, so let's maybe drive one home, huh? Cut her away. Pop that a little early, I suspect. That's, that's uh, ball one. Sinker down and in. Taking ball two. Not the best start here, but they may just decide that Solomon's not worth the trouble. Looked like that one tied him up a bit, a mm. swing and a miss. Hey, that was a nasty pitch right there. It's the depth of a sinker. Sometimes it's a matter of whether or not it's moving east-west, but that one right Well, there that's just a pop fly. Right field. Hennigan. Nice can of Gorn, and uh, that is going to be not even a tag up from second base, and that's the second out of the inning. And Solomon coming back out. Bottom four, still two to one. Mariners on top. He blew out in his last at bat. Sinker down and away. Ball one. Leading off the inning here. Nobody on, nobody out. Sinker down. Now it's a little early on that one, even. Another sinker. To be voted in by his fans to start in the All Star game right now. The one two. And chop that one away. away. So that's three sinkers in a row, bottom of the zone. And there's another one coming below the zone. Whoa, that I misses can't. and we're even at two and two. I don't blame the pitcher one bit for trying well, to get the sinkers are nasty, right man. They come in looking real good and they drop He's at the last got second. The entire arsenal open to him. So we'll see what pitch he comes with next. But yeah, Solomon swings and misses, and that'll be the, the first, first out of the down. inning. Boy, that's really Have a seat and get comfortable. It has wheels, right? All he wants to do is get Next to be the cleanup hitter, Solomon Barrio. He's over to bottom six. And it's Cutter fouled off. Still Kendall Graveman out on the mound out here. He's pitched for five and a third. The 0 1 on its way. And a pitch Sinker one down and away. Ball it's one. one, one. Right now. And come back Another one down. As the count moves to two and one now. Hey, one time. Right one now. out, Here nobody on. Oh, and this Connected on absolute that absolute one, blasting. and Solomon just gonna watch it fly. Adios, Pelota, number 20 on the year for Solomon Barrios. 
big one to right center field and gone. That is another big fly for Salomon Luis Aparicio Barrios Garcia. When they need a clutch hit or an offensive blast, he's their go-to guy. And he's coming out here one more time. Bottom eight, nobody on, nobody out. Fresh pitcher out here to face Solomon. Inside splitter taken. 27,690 fans in Angel Stadium of Anaheim. Angels, thank you for your support. Been a good game today so far, 2-2 in the bottom of the eighth. Solomon, of course, would love to tie it up with another big bomb here, but I guess we'll find out if he can make it happen. 2-0 count now. Well, this is the matchup they wanted bringing in the reliever, but falling behind 2-0 doesn't exactly help the situation. Another one, splitter down and away. Court a hit while ahead in the walk, of course. Or ahead in the count, excuse me. Four pitch walk, Solomon on base. Chase and Shreve. Four pitch walk here to Solomon. And he can really wreak some havoc on the bases. Two balls and a strike to the Two one count here. A lot of times you'll see the take sign after five straight balls to start the inning, but with the middle of the order up at the plate here, I wouldn't be surprised if he That's a pop fly, center field, right and shallow. Campillo comes on now, and he has it one down. That'll be the first out of the inning. Here's Justin Upton now. He's working His motion looks reasonably... Oh, I did it again. But a high throw to second base means that Solomon still gets out there. So that's on the catcher, not on the pitcher. Pitcher threw out on that one, so... Might have been a different story if Solomon had... If uh, catcher hadn't thrown a high ball to uh, second base. Shot at the hot corner, and that is going to be the second out of the inning. Ready for another shot now. JT Real Muto. Not much in the way of productivity from him so far, but he's got a chance to be here in a crucial spot. All right, JT Real Muto coming up. Two out, 1 1 count, and Solomon on second. Fouls that back. Puts it in the stands back behind home plate. Another one. JT dispensing souvenirs out here. Ready with the one two. And he lays off the fastball to the outside. Probably wasn't a fastball. They do show what pitches they are. That's going straight up the middle, though, so Solomon is going to round third and head on home. And JT Real Muto getting into second on, an, or excuse me, getting into first with an RBI single. Solomon coming home from second on that base hit up the middle. Let's go, Venga! Right between Chase and Shreve's legs. And Solomon getting one more shot here. It's late in the game, 5-3. They're down again. Angel blew the lead again. The bullpen did, excuse me. Ooh, nice fastball up and in. Good timing. Solomon just could not make contact on that sucker. Another one. And that is going to drive two runners up in the... Kind of drive two runners ahead. So now we got two men in scoring position. Good timing on that one, but could not connect on it. I kind of like the aggressive attitude right here. I know he's in a jam. 
he do? He goes through his best that's stuff. That's Four-seamer inside, two ball two. two. Angels down to their last strike. Fouled off. That was not a good one to hit, but I couldn't really rely on... Couldn't really rely on the ump to call that one a ball, honestly. And this ball swung on it Connected on it. But that's just going to be a fly out to right field, and that is going to end the game. Mariners dropped this one. 5-3. to three. The bullpen gave it up late. Despite Solomon hitting another home run out here. It's going to be, three, at the very least, a split series. And in fact, they sat Solomon for one game. I, looks like I get some free stuff. That's fine, I suppose. Looks like they sat Solomon for one game of that series. And it's a three to one series victory for the Angels this time. So I think that's going to do it for me for today. So until next time, I'm Tyrant Saber, and I will see you at the ballpark.